Good morning, Guardians. It's another Zer weekend, and I got a feeling you're gonna like what he has. Follow me. So not only does he have a weapon this weekend, finally, it is the brand new Hereafter Sniper Rifle. Whoa. The exotic perk on this is that it has a chance to blind nearby enemies on precision kills. I've never had one before, so you can be sure I'm going to pick up one of these babies. Oh, also, and it allows you to zoom in further when you crouch, which is pretty cool. Moving on, Warlocks, you get the stag. I don't have a Warlock, so I don't know how well this performs, but I see quite a bit of people running this helmet. I don't know if it's an aesthetic choice, but couldn't hurt to pick one up. Hunters get the Don't Touch Me gauntlets. These came in the dark below. These are one of my favorite exotics for a hunter. You get meleeed, you turn invisible, and the cooldown is only two seconds. Titans get no backup plans. They have been reconfigured for the Taken King a tiny bit, but they're not really game changing like the way Skullford has with two melee charges where your one version doesn't do that at all. So we have three of coins and the new glass needles. This is going to allow you to basically re-roll or reforge your exotic gear. Uh, I'm definitely picking some of these up because my Saint 14 does not have inverse shadow and I really like that perk for extra super energy against minions of darkness so picking those up definitely. And for anyone who still is confused, this is a legacy engram. This is only for year one exotics to complete your collection. And you can get those year two blueprints if available. That's it. Well, that's it for today, guys. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to share, like, and subscribe to my channel for more Destiny content. My name is Chit, and I approve this message.